Moment of truth. Oh, for the first time ever they actually have it. Good morning everyone, how's it hanging? How's everyone doing? Today is Thursday. I have woken up this morning, edited two vlogs, I've done a bunch of stuff on my laptop, I've actually booked my train tickets back home, so I finally know when I'm going to be heading home for Christmas, it's in a couple of days time, so I'm so excited. I woke up this morning from a text message from my mum saying that she will go into Leeds today to go to the Christmas market and do like some Christmas shopping with her friends, and I'm so so jealous because I would have been invited if I were back home. Obviously, can't go because I'm in London, and I don't feel Christmassy right now, so I'm just like counting down the days literally, not until Christmas but until I go home to get in the Christmas spirit and actually spend time with my friends and my family do something like Christmas I really want to go ice skating I tried to get Haz, Saf and Anna to go ice skating with me but I don't think we're gonna have time so that's the situation I woke up this morning also if you didn't see yesterday's vlog I got my lips topped up and the bruising on this side in fact it's pretty much just bruised both sides and it's really swollen in the middle of my lip so just ignore that we're gonna move on from it today a really dull day again I feel like this is why I don't daily vlog I don't know if you guys find it interesting let me know if you do but my everyday day life for me is just really bland. If I'm not sat at my desk editing, then I'm filming. And if I'm not filming, then I'm in a meeting. And if I'm not in a meeting, then we're recording the podcast. I just don't really do too much. However, you'll be excited to know I am actually leaving the house today. I need to make myself some breakfast right now. And then I'm going to head to Westfields because I've got some parcels to take to the post office. But also, I really want Haz to cut me my hair tonight. If you didn't know, Haz cuts me my hair just because I don't trust anyone to not make me bald. The last time I got my hair cut in London, the person literally made me bald. And then I had to go to Saf's 18th birthday party. It were a mess. I hated it. But I'm planning on getting my hair cut tonight and I also maybe I'm going to bleach it. I have a bunch of bleachers left over from when Bleach London sent me like a little goodie pack but I don't actually have any toner so I think I'm going to nip into Super Drugo boots, grab myself a toner because right now even though my hair looks really blonde if I lift it up it's literally like half blonde half brown like my roots are so bad and I do like the look of the, the like silver hair or blonde hair that's been grown out like, like it is now. However I were on the phone to my mum last night and she was just like wow it just really doesn't look like it's even meant to be cool now. It looks like it's just grown out. So I think I'm going to bleach my full head of hair back blonde. I'm in two minds because I think it looks really good but I remember how much it takes to maintain. Like to keep it the certain type of blonde that I want it like a platinum colour is really hard. So maybe we'll bleach my hair tonight. Who knows? At least I'm getting out of the house you know. So look at this t-shirt that I found in my wardrobe the other day. I knew I had it but I literally just forgot and I was clearing out my wardrobe. If you've not seen that main channel video it went up yesterday for me like two days for you. And I found this in my wardrobe which is really cool. It's like a vintage look Star Trek t-shirt that's actually from ASOS. I'm so annoyed that I ripped the neck. Like I purposely did it thinking it'd look cool but now I just wish it were like this. But sadly I ripped the neck trying to be like edgy and quirky and stuff but this is what I'm wearing today. Just literally the most cosy outfit ever. Some really stretchy trousers from Gap. Then just this oversized t-shirt. I'm gonna throw on a jumper and a coat obviously when I go to Westfields. But yeah I really like this t-shirt and I forgot I got it. <laughs> Right, I'm all dressed and ready now. I've put on this All Saints little leather jacket. I now have my ASOS jumper on as well. This jumper's really, really cool, by the way. My new bag, of course, and I just literally put my Air Forces on. We're gonna head to Westfields now. I need to do a bunch of things I've realized. I need to look in All Saints because I'm gonna be working with them on something. I need to, I don't have to get packaging and like wrapping paper and stuff now and wrap the presents before I take them home. I still haven't decided that. I mentioned it in the last vlog, but I've not decided what I wanna do with that yet. And yeah, also need to go to the post office, right? It's literally getting dark already. This is so annoying. But we need to go to Westfields. I'm mean, like two minutes into this vlog and that's the colour of the sky. Fabulous. Right, just ignore my hair, it's blowing everywhere. But me and Haz are walking to Westfields and we're walking a long way because we want to look at everyone's Christmas trees in the house. Because we don't have anything. So we were like, right, we're going to walk the long way. We're going to look at everyone's houses. And no one's turned the lights on yet, which is not surprising considering it's like four o'clock. Um, well, I mean, it's dark, but like I would have thought everyone would have had the lights on and they don't. Also, I'm vlogging like this because my forehead is huge, oh, and here it is. <laughs> but yeah, this disappointing. Is a really random thing. Um, you know, you just mentioned spiders. Yeah. You had a dead spider on your white top. I know, yeah, in my washing. Yeah, when I was taking my washing it's off, there were a, spa a massive spider, like, what they were dead. And I shook, I literally should have seen me shaking my clothes before putting them in my wardrobe. But like, if there's any eggs in here, I'm not putting them on my body. But I don't anyway. know how it got in. Me neither. It's because Freya, oh, Freya didn't organise the shoe, um, the drying rack properly. So she puts, like, long things at the bottom so it could have climbed up. Ooh. Like, I it put the longest thing, things at the top. I know. It died on your I know, right? We're just gonna move on from that, right? We're walking to Westfields. We still know Christmas lights. And if I get bit by a spider, Tom Holland, come at me. I just heard the <laughs> Moment of truth. 
Oh, for the first time ever they actually have it. Should I get this colour again? Should I get this colour again? Yeah, bro. Right, so we're just in Primark and look at these dressing gowns that they've got. This is just for Ella to watch. Ella, look at these. We could have a matching ones. Look at my That's so funny. Yeah, it's his face. Yeah, That's so yeah, funny. Yeah. Right, I need to Snapchat Ella this. Oh my god. Prayer is somewhere in Primark right now and we're also in Primark. So we're gonna play a game of let's see if we can find her before she finds us. And then we're gonna stay hidden. This is gonna be hard. It looks like I put like Halloween lip liner on. Turns out Freya went in Primark. I wanna go to see Frozen, Freya. I wanna see Frozen. Oh, we should go see Frozen. I haven't got my tickets. How's we can just pay to go? Why doesn't Baron pay for you and then you give him one of your free tickets? I actually hate this. But then you're still getting it. Still using your I can't do paper. look at this, I can't pout my lips. <laughs> like it goes to one side anyway. <laughs> oh. Oof, that's way too low. So we're back from Westfields now. As you can see, I'm back in my room. My hair needs dying so bad. Um, I've just been sat watching a few people's vlogmases and I'm like, oops, I've not even vlogged and updated my vlog to tell everyone that I'm back home. Um, but I'm back home. My little trip to All Saints were pretty much a fail. However, I went online once I got back and found some pieces, basically. I got a comment on my Instagram the other day from All Saints themselves. And I was like, wait, what? Because I bought a jacket from there the other day uh, and I tagged it on my Instagram photo as I do with everything that I for you guys to know where I buy my clothes from and where I'm shopping certain places and All Saints actually commented on my vlog saying that they loved the post so my management reached out to them and they very kindly said they're gonna give me some stuff so I just had to choose a few pieces which is literally crazy to me I never thought a brand like All Saints would ever want to give me anything however you never know, clearly. But now I'm back home and I feel really, really cosy. I don't know if it's because we've walked like around in the cold, come back in, it's nice and warm. I've literally in like a big cosy jumper and I've just been sat on my bed like nestled up. I got some chocolate and stuff from Sainsbury's on the way back past and I've literally just been sat in my bed eating chocolates, watching videos in a big hoodie and it's like nice and warm. We literally only walked from Westfields back to our house. Um, but like I said, it's freezing cold outside. So coming into the warm with like a big cosy jumper and I just feel really cosy tonight. I need to make myself some food and stuff. I also need to cut my hair. And also, actually, I really miss my fairy lights. Like, I was just sat with my light off and I'm like, it's really dull. I wish my fairy lights were here to create some sort of ambience. I didn't get rid of my fairy lights, by the way. They literally used to be hung on this back wall here. And they still are. Like, they still hung up behind my wardrobe. But before my wardrobe used to be there, I used to have them on that wall. And I literally didn't take them off that wall. I just put my wardrobe over them, which is kind of dumb because now I'm going to have to climb up onto my wardrobe to unhook them from the, like, corners of the ceiling. Because I really want to put them above where my bed currently is. I think if I have my fairy lights oh is it gonna focus I think if I have my fairy lights like hung from that corner to that corner like dangling down or even like up there and along this little thing I think that'd be really really cute so I'm gonna attempt to untangle my fairy lights the plug from's down there so it goes all the way along the back of there and then up I'm gonna have to like untangle it as it gets like round here because it's literally tangled up and just pray that they work <laughs> Right, I finally, this took me such a long time. It was literally all wrapped up around there and then behind my wardrobe. I don't know how that happened, but the fairy lights have been taken down. Oh, I've got nowhere to plug them in. I guess I'm gonna have to plug them in there, which is kind of annoying. But now I've got to climb up there. So we're gonna film this. Probably not gonna go right, but we're just gonna wait and see. There's a little sticky thing up there that I can see, but I need to put one in that corner because I don't think there is one up there. Man, I said he fell over. Ta-da! I feel like my room's back to like me now. It is kind of annoying that it's like my bed's not central on that wall. We're just gonna have to deal with it. And now I can turn my lights off. Oh. 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 Are we are we alright guys? Hanging in there. I just decided to put the excess down there, you know, by the little plan. Lovely. Now I'm gonna get back on my bed and continue watching Vlogmas. <laughs> One of the reasons I cannot wait to go home is purely because I eat the same shit whenever I'm in London. Like, all I eat every single day is pasta. And I'm bored of it, so guess what I'm making for my dinner? Pasta, because I have nothing else in my cupboard. Um, and it's just easy, I guess. I was gonna order food, but I don't wanna have McDonald's, and there's nothing really else on Deliveroo, or not Deliveroo, actually, because I got hacked on Deliveroo, so I don't have a Deliveroo account. But there's not um, anything else on Uber Eats that I really want, so I'm gonna make myself some pasta, which is really boring. Has them Freya? Joint cook tonight, which were really sweet. We've never done that as a household. Like, my mum always says, do you not, like, cook together? And it's like, we've never... 
Right, uh, I thought someone were outside. <laughs> My mum always says, do you ever cook together? We never do, but has and Freya cooked a um, coma tonight. However, I'm the whitest person alive and I don't like even a coma, so love that for me. It really does look like I've got lip, lip liner on. That was beautiful. Oh, I had my hair cut, by the way. I still need to dye it. I don't know if to dye it by blonde or not. Please, someone let me know. But I ordered McDonald's! I literally ordered a cheeseburger and a drink. And next on what love, period. Hasn't Freya been playing Monopoly ever since House cut me my hair? They've literally just been sat in there playing Monopoly on their own world together. So I thought I'd come in my room, order food, and just chill. Okay, it's currently 10 past 11, so I'm actually going to go to bed soon once I get this. Mm -mm -mm. Right, guys, I'm going to end the podcast. End the podcast? I'm going to end this video here. I, I'm saying podcast because I've just thought. I just discovered, actually, that Trisha Paytas has a podcast, so I'm currently listening to the episode with her and Jeffrey, and my hair is really pissing me off. I just look gross. So I'm going to end the vlog as well for that reason. I really haven't done much today. So I'm sorry that this vlog is short. I hope you enjoyed it regardless. I'm so glad that I put my fairy lights up. I don't know why I didn't do that sooner. Anyway, I love you all lots and I will see you in the morning with a brand new video. I'm going to lay in bed, listen to Jeffrey and Trisha Paytas. I know I said Shane and Jeffrey then. I'm so used to saying them as like two. Uh, I'm going to listen to Trisha and... Oh my god. I'm going to listen to Trisha and Jeffrey's podcast. This is a mess. I'll update you on the bruising on my lips tomorrow. This is what it looks like today. And yeah, apart from that, I love you all lots and I'll chat to you in the morning. Bye. Sorry that this vlog was really bad. I do apologise.